The McCoyan MiG-25, NATO reporting name, Foxbat. The MiG-25 is a supersonic interceptor and reconnaissance aircraft that was designed by the Soviet Union's Mikoyan Gurevich Design Bureau. It was one of the fastest military aircraft ever produced, with a top speed of Mach 2.83. The MiG-25 has a number of capabilities that make it a formidable interceptor aircraft, including its high speed, high altitude, and high rate of climb. However, it also has some limitations, such as its lack of maneuverability at high speeds and its difficulty flying at low altitudes. Foxbat has a top speed of Mach 2.83, but it could reach a maximum speed of at least Mach 3.2 with the risk of engine damage. The MiG-31 was designed to address these limitations and to provide the Soviet Air Force with a more capable interceptor aircraft. The development of the MiG-25's replacement began with the Yi-155 MP prototype, which first flew in September 1975. Although it resembled the MiG-25 in some ways, it had a longer fuselage to accommodate the radar operator's cockpit and was a new design in many respects. An important development was the MiG-31's advanced radar, which could engage targets both above and below the aircraft, as well as track multiple targets simultaneously. This gave the Soviet Union an interceptor capable of engaging the most likely Western threats, such as low-flying cruise missiles and bombers, at long ranges. The MiG-31 replaced the Tu-128 as the Soviet Union's dedicated long-range interceptor. It was equipped with far more advanced sensors and weapons than the MiG-25, and its range was almost double that of its predecessor. The introduction of the MiG-31 was surrounded by speculation and misinformation about its design and capabilities. This was due in part to the defection of Lieutenant Viktor Belenko to Japan in 1976. Belenko, who flew a MiG-25P to Japan, described an upcoming Super Foxbat with two seats and an ability to intercept cruise missiles. However, his testimony about the new interceptor's air intakes was incorrect, as the MiG-31 does not have intakes similar to the MiG-23. Despite the misinformation, the MiG-31 was a significant improvement over the MiG-25. The Foxhound entered serial production in 1979 and was produced until 1994. The first production batch consisted of 519 aircraft, including 349 baseline models. The second batch of 101 MiG-31DZ was produced from 1989 to 1991. The final batch of 69 MiG-31B aircraft was produced between 1990 and 1994. Of the baseline models, 40 airframes were upgraded to MiG-31BS standard. After the dissolution of the Soviet Union, 50 of the final batch of MiG-31B aircraft were retained by the Kazakhstan Air Force. The Russian Air Force currently operates 130 Foxhounds. The MiG-31 has been upgraded several times, with the most recent version being the MiG-31BM. The MiG-31 shares some similarities with the MiG-25, such as its large twin-engine configuration, side-mounted air intake ramps, shoulder-mounted wing with an aspect ratio of 2.94, and twin vertical tail fins. The MiG-31's wings and airframe are stronger than those of the MiG-25, allowing it to fly at supersonic speeds at low altitudes. The aircraft's flight surfaces are made primarily of nickel-steel alloy, which can withstand the heat generated at speeds approaching Mach 3. The MiG-31 airframe is made of 49% arc, welded nickel-steel, 33% light metal alloy, 16% titanium, and 2% composites. The MiG-31 is limited to 5G when flying at supersonic speeds. Its wing loading is marginal when flying under combat weight, but its thrust-to-weight ratio is favorable. The MiG-31 is not designed for dogfight or rapid turning. The MiG-31 is a large aircraft with a length of 22.62 meters, a wingspan of 13.4 meters, and a height of 6.4 meters. The aircraft has a wing area of 61.6 square meters. The empty weight of the Foxhound is 48,105 pounds, and the maximum takeoff weight is 101,854 pounds. The MiG-31 is powered by two Solovyev D-30 F6 afterburning turbofan engines, each with a thrust of 34,000 lbf with afterburner. Aircraft has a maximum speed of Mach 
2.83 at an altitude of 70,538 feet, it has a cruise speed of Mach 2.35. The MiG-31 has a range of 1,900 miles with four R-33E missiles and two drop tanks. With one aerial refueling, the range can be extended to 3,400 miles. The MiG-31 has a service ceiling of 82,000 feet. The rate of climb is 56,700 feet per minute. The MiG-31 was the world's first operational fighter aircraft to be equipped with a passive electronically scanned array radar the Zaslon S-800. The radar has a maximum range of approximately 200 kilometers against fighter-sized targets and can track up to 10 targets and simultaneously attack four of them with its R-33 missiles. The radar is also equipped with an infrared search and track system. The MiG-31 was the only fighter aircraft in service with a passive electronically scanned array radar until 2000 when the Mitsubishi F-2 entered service with the APG-1 Active Phased Array Radar. MiG-31BM standard aircraft have an upgraded Zaslon M radar with larger antenna and greater detection range. The Zaslon M radar has a search range of 400 kilometers and can track 24 targets at once, engaging six of them. The relative target speed detection range has also been increased from Mach 5 to Mach 6, improving the probability of destroying fast-moving targets. The MiG-31BM is one of only a few aircraft able to intercept and destroy cruise missiles flying at extremely low altitudes. A group of four MiG-31 interceptors can control an area of airspace across a total length of 800 to 900 kilometers. The MiG-31 armed 23mm rotary cannon with up to 800 rounds. However, this cannon was later removed from some aircraft. Aircraft can carry a total of up to 20,000 pounds of ordnance. The MiG-31's main armament is four R-33 air-to-air -air missiles with a range of up to 300 kilometers carried under the belly. Fuselage recesses four R-37 long-range air-to-air -air missile with a range of up to 400 kilometers. MiG-31BM can carry up to four R-77M active radar homing beyond visual range air-to-air -air missile and four R-73 air-to-air missiles, as well as up to four KH-58 anti-radiation missiles and MiG-31K can carry one KH-47M2. Kinzhal Hypersonic Air-Launched Ballistic Missile The Kinzhal is a hypersonic air-to-surface missile. It is designed to carry nuclear or conventional warheads and can travel at speeds of up to Mach 10.